pictures for me. The sisters. I wonder what those dear little girls can be about. Oh, I know. The oldest one is teaching her little sister her letters. That's just the way I do with our little Susie. She says A, B, so cunning, but she calls W, double do. It sounds so funny, but never mind. By and by, she can speak plain, and then how nice it will be for her to know her letters and read in the Bible and picture books. The sweep. I guess that's a little chimney sweep. But they don't look so nice and clean. Perhaps they do, though when their faces are washed. What an ugly business it must be. Only think, to be in a great black chimney all alone. But still God is with them, even in the dark, if they only knew it. Poor little boy, I wonder if anybody tells you about Jesus. I would if I could see you. Gathering Nuts I know that boy is getting some nuts. It is autumn, and the trees are full. That is just the way Jack and Mother and I used to go in the dark, cool woods. It was so pleasant there. My little sister calls the moss God's carpet. Yes, in the trees and the fruits, the beautiful hills, and all that is in the world belong to God. How can we thank him for giving us these things to enjoy? Mother says, by giving our hearts to him. Old Towser. I can almost see that dog jump. He looks like our old king that saved my life once. I disobeyed my mother and ran down to the river with king. It was the Sabbath day, and I knew I was breaking God's commandments. There was a boat there, and I got in and loosened the rope. By and by, I stepped on one side, and over I went. King heard me scream, and on he came, dash into the water, and caught me just as I was going down. I will never break God's holy day again. Mother and Child This is a sweet good mother, I know, and she loves her little girl. Oh, how I do pity boys and girls who have no darling mother. Sometimes I sit and think that I will never, never grieve my mother anymore, and I do try. When I make her sad, it takes away all my comfort, and I ask God to forgive me. The Bible says, Honor thy father and thy mother, that thy days may be long in the land. Little Willie I think that picture looks like little Willie Lawrence, who was killed on the railroad a year ago. He was a dear little boy and used to play with me. He came running into the house that day for a cup of milk. His mother gave it to him. When he drank it, he said, Oh, what nice milk. I thank God for it. Alas, they were the last words his mother heard from his lips. He was crossing the track, and the dreadful engine came. Well, Willie loved his Sabbath school, and his mother says he was a little Christian boy. He is in heaven, for of such, Christ said, is the kingdom of heaven. Looking at the moon. I went out last night and walked in the beautiful moonlight. This picture makes me think of it. We could see the color of the little flowers. It was so light. When I look at the moon, it is so pure and white, it makes me want to be pure and white too. I can be, for Jesus has promised to make me. Dear Savior, help me never to use bad words or think bad thoughts. Help me when I look up in the clear heavens to feel that Thou art there, and if I am good and true in this life, I shall be fair and shining as the new moon in the courts of the heavenly palaces. Finding pictures. I don't exactly know what paper they are looking at, but I do know what paper I love to look at. That is our dear reaper. I suppose they have found some pictures there that interest them. I never knew anyone who didn't love pictures. Old Uncle James, whose hair is white as snow, hunts all the papers and books for pictures. He says he can make his own stories out of them. I think there are a great many pictures out of doors that people don't see. The trees, the lambs in the field, a beautiful cloud in the sky, the grain all glistening and nodding. These are God's pictures. He is the wonderful artist. The End